We've just seen how to surf through Foxtel's amazing TV guide. If you've had a zip around the All Channels list of the TV Guide, you've probably noticed how the channels are loosely grouped into types. There's general entertainment, movies, sport, news, docos, kids, music, and so on. Also, you may have seen that some of the channels have plus two versions, which is the same channel delayed by two hours, giving you more chances to see the good stuff. OK, but let's say we're exploring the TV Guide. We come across a show that looks like it could be good value and we want to find out more about it. This is where you press this, the I button on the remote. I stands for information, and that's exactly what you get. Highlight any show in the guide. Press I, and this window pops up, giving you the full name of the show, who's in it, and what it's all about. You can also find out the program's classification, whether it has subtitles or closed captioning, and if it's a widescreen presentation or broadcast in Dolby surround sound. Once you've found out what you need to know, just click the I button again and you're back to the guide. OK, now let me show you a great little surfing trick. You can cruise through the TV guide and watch Foxtel at the same time. While watching a show, simply press the up or down button on the remote and this banner pops up. We can see what channel we're watching, what's on now, and what's on next. Keep pressing the up or down button and you can scroll through other channels in the TV guide like this. If you want to find out a bit more about any of these shows, press the I button and up comes the info. Press it again to return to the previous screen. And if you want to watch the show, press select. We've just seen how to search through what's being broadcast on Foxtel right now. But looking ahead at what shows are coming up, that's where Foxtel leaves ordinary old TV for dead. Check this out. I'll press TV Guide and select All Channels. Now here we are again at the All Channels screen. By using the right arrow on the remote, we can look ahead in time to see what's coming up like this. Notice how the times at the top of the row are moving along as we click through? So even though the current time is 2 p.m., I'm now looking at what's on at 8 p.m. tonight. You can keep clicking and look ahead for a whole week if you like. And you can find out more about shows along the way by pressing the I button on the remote. Now, here comes the magic part. The more you flip through the guide, the more shows you're going to find that you feel like watching. But how do you remember to watch them all? Well, in the old days, you might put a circle around it in the TV magazine. But with Foxtel, you press select and stick the show into the planner. The planner is your very own TV guide that you fill with nothing but the shows you're interested in. Anytime you press select on a show that isn't screening yet, you'll be brought to this, the planner screen, where your selected shows will be added to your very own planner list. To go back to where you were in the TV guide, press the remote's back button. And you can view the contents of your planner at any time by clicking the planner button here. This is what flexible TV is all about. The new way to watch telly is by ripping through the TV guide, selecting anything that takes your fancy and building your own chunk of TV greatness. Before the show starts, you'll get an on-screen reminder to tune into it. IQ users, you don't even have to be there to watch it. When you're building your planner, you just hit the record button on the remote and the IQ box will grab the show for you just like a VCR would. And once it's recorded, you can watch that show whenever you want. But unlike a VCR, the Foxtel IQ can record two programs at once. So next time there's two good shows on at the same time, just grab them both. You can even play back a previously recorded show from your IQ planner whilst the other two are both recording. Now, depending on what type of programming you select, you can grab around 60 hours of Foxtel Digital TV. Meaning with Foxtel IQ, there's always something good to watch, ready to go. It's TV rescheduled, TV your way. When we return, I'll show you a great way to build a planner to knock your socks off.
We've just seen one way to build a great planner with nothing but your kind of TV. But the Foxtel Guide often lets you get the same result in a different way. The Search Programs menu is another way of selecting shows for your planner. And even getting to that, I could do in a few ways. I could arrow button all the way down to it like this and press select. Or I could simply hit the arrow up button once and get there that way because the digital guides menus loop around this way. But the quickest method is using the numbered keypad part of the remote. So to get to zero search programs, I hit zero like this. Now we're at the search programs menu. You can browse through Foxtel chronologically by time, alphabetically by name, or find shows with closed captioning for the hearing impaired. We'll choose using the numbered keypad method again. So I'll press 1, Programs by Time, then 1, All Programs. What we're now looking at is a list of all programs on Foxtel sorted by time. From here, you select shows to watch now or chuck into your planner for later to either get a reminder or to record if you have an IQ. Right, I'm going to press the back button on the remote a couple of times. And now we're back at the search programs page. And I'm going to press two programs by A to Z. And why not three movies? We now have every movie for the next few days listed in alphabetical order. And just like before, we can navigate through this list. Press select, or record if you have an IQ, and whack that show into your planner. Now, so your thumb doesn't fall off, you can jump ahead through the alphabet using the numbered keypad part of the remote. Let's say I wanted to see movies beginning with L. You can see on the numbered keypad that L is the third letter on the five button. So I'd press the five button three times in a row like this. And here I am at movies that start with the letter L. Good one. One of the greatest things about the Foxtel Guide is that you don't have to remember much beyond the few basic self-explanatory buttons. All through the Foxtel Guide, you'll notice prompts that tell you what you can do. Items displayed on screen correspond with various buttons on the remote control. For example, see these four coloured icons in the TV Guide? Well, they correspond with these four colour buttons on the remote. These buttons change what they do depending on what page is on your screen. So whilst you're on this TV Guide page, the red and green buttons are page up and page down buttons, working in the same way as the channel plus minus button does. The yellow button will jump you forward through the TV Guide by one day. So now we're looking at what's happening 24 hours from now. As you jump ahead into the week, the guide tells you what day you're looking at right here. And this is the current day and time, if, like me, you're always forgetting what day it is. The blue button, as you can see, zips you back in 24-hour chunks. But that's only what these buttons mean on this page. If we click over to the planner, we can see the yellow button here has a different function. Here, the yellow button deletes items from your planner list. The blue button on the IQ Planner lets you keep recordings to help prevent shows from being accidentally deleted. Let's go back over to the A to Z listings. In the Movies list, the coloured buttons further refine the list to movie genres of your choice. And I can use the right arrow button to see further options. Let me back button to here and select Sport. The coloured buttons here refine my alphabetical list to types of sport programs. I'll just press blue for soccer, and here's a list of shows all about soccer. Now, the good news about all of this colour button stuff is that you don't have to remember any of it, because everything you need to know is right up on the screen. Just like the rest of the TV guide, if you can see the screen, you'll always know what to do. But wait, there's more. When we return, we'll take a look at even more of Foxtel's great entertainment options.